Hello everybody, a warm welcome back, very warm. 36 degrees in Tirana today. It is absolutely boiling. I'm sweating like a pig. Any football fans out there, you're going to enjoy this vlog. This afternoon, I collected my football tickets to go and see Tirana v Dynamo Batumi, who are from Georgia, play in the first qualifying round of the Europa Conference League. <laughs> leg one of two how much was this football ticket it was 500 albanian lek what i'm learning about albania and tirana especially is that it's very very cheap here before we do that we're gonna have to have a couple of beers and have some food and there's a really good place where i've um, been, ha been hanging out the last couple of nights the old bazaar in Tirana. I first saw this when I was on my walking tour, which you may have seen as that was part of my first episode. And if you like cheap food and cheap beer, this is the area of Tirana you want to be hanging out in. So let's go and um, possibly grab some food, definitely grab some beer, and uh, let's relax. We've got about two hours until kickoff. marketplace in the old bazaar selling all sorts of different things from um, pipes to rugs to watermelons to uh, rolling tobacco <laughs> uh, yeah a bit of everything here it's quite cool and that's the thing about Tirana it's like there's a bit of Turkish influence here you've got the Mediterranean influence you've got a bit of, bit of Eastern Europe influence <laughs> Oh, looks like we've got some um, loads of dried fruits and peanuts. Lovely colours. Mm. They look nice. Cashew nuts, olives. Prunes or something. Oh, all looks good to me. And as you, as also you can see, just how incredibly quiet it is. It's around six o'clock now, and it's just, it's quite peaceful in a way. After after being in some pretty hectic cities such as Prague, Budapest, London, it's actually nice to come to a smaller city. But you kind of you can roam about a little bit by yourself. It's great. I've got the whole of Tirana to myself. Came in here last night and this place is unbelievably cheap. Um, can't quite remember how much I paid. There was a big group of us from the hostel came here yesterday. But I'll let you know the prices of uh, the beer and if they do food, I'll grab some of that as well. Nice, just ordered my food, pre-match meal. And just to let you know, as I'm looking through the menu, if you want some veal brain, this is the spot to come to. <laughs> Cheers bro. Well, I'm happy now. Look at this. I've got my homemade meatballs. I've got my, my tavir koshi, which is bubbling away. I've got my bread and I've got my beer. Okay, what an absolutely brilliant meal that was and drinks. Three pints and all that food for 1,070 Albanian lek. Now that's a bargain. 
it's cooled down a bit now it's coming towards the evening anyway right off to the stadium let's go kickoffs in about half an hour and about a 10 minute walk so let's get a move on denied entry into the stadium maybe i was a little bit naive about taking a gopro in but uh i didn't realize the security would be quite that strict um i got searched twice going into that stadium i got through the first one but i couldn't get through the second one um that's put a bit of a dampener on the day this whole vlog the trials and tribulations of being a travel vlogger luckily the ticket didn't cost me very much I should have maybe gone home quickly and then just filmed it on my um, camera. The game's probably going to be a classic now as well. I'm actually a bit guided about that. You make an entire travel vlog dedicated to a football match and then I got denied entry. But I don't know, I haven't been to a football match in so long. Maybe taking a GoPro into the stadium was a bad idea. Oh my God. Well, Anyone in Tirana want a free football ticket? Well, that brings the end to this vlog. I hope everybody enjoyed the football match as much as I did. Let's go back to a bar and drown my sorrows. Hope everybody enjoyed it. Let's work, hope <laughs> everybody enjoyed my video. <laughs> Let's work more travel. I had some nice food and some cheap beers though at least. I might as well do that again. See you again soon.